Hello once again everybody, this is Multi Holsters coming at you, www.multiholsters.com is my website address and multiholsters at yahoo.com is my email address in case you'd like to drop me a line uh, with a question, comment, concern. I want to come at you today with uh, a quick video. Uh, one thing that we uh, started adding to the um, holster lineup uh, because uh, we had quite a bit of uh, requests for it are uh, flashlight holders. And uh, basically we um, had incorporated, I had to come up with like a, a design and give you of course options because that's what we do here at Multi. Now one of the ones that uh, kind of started this whole uh, flashlight phase and, and got me into it was the, uh, this is the Surefire uh, R1 Lawman flashlight. It is a 750 lumen flashlight. It's uh, more or less a, 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 a police officer flashlight, police officer, law enforcement, um, perhaps a first responder, uh, military type of flashlight. Um, it can definitely be a homeowner's home light or flashlight, but uh, very expensive, very well built, very uh, you know highly um, uh, crafted uh, piece of, uh, of machinery here. And um, from what I understand, nobody could find a decent holder for this flashlight. So I've had uh, several agencies and police departments contact me and uh, it kind of prompted me to uh, start making the flashlight holder. Now just so you know, uh, we do gear these towards, like I say, the law enforcement crowd. And uh, basically because it's such a long flashlight, the only way that I can make these and make them work properly is to have them bezel up. This of course being the bezel. And uh, that's really the only way anything other than that, if I do it, it might uh, toss around. Um, it didn't really work out when I did this and it got to be really big and bulky. So the only way that we're offering this is uh, bezel up and I'll show you a couple features on it in just a minute. But the body of the holster is made out of 0.93, uh, whole, uh, I'm sorry, 0.93 Kydex. And we do on these, we uh, offer a uh, tech lock system. So it is a, a fully adjustable type of um, uh, belt fastening system. Of course, you got your uh, your bar here that locks it in. And the nice thing about these is it is fully adjustable. Uh, the other thing is, is if you wanted to adjust the tension in between the holster, if you wanted to um, make it a little bit tighter or looser, depending on your, your liking, you can adjust these screws here. But uh, essentially, uh, what we did on this is the uh, flashlight, of course, has this tail cap, the uh, activation switch. So when you put it in, we actually crown out the bottom so it does not come into contact. The other part of this flashlight has an on-off switch right here, actually, and that's how you adjust the, uh, the beam uh, wattage. It has a switch right here, and a lot of the agencies wanted it covered, so we incorporated like a little shield. Um, so it can't accidentally, if it's up against your body, it can't accidentally turn that button or the, the, uh, the, the flashlight on. Of course, it's got fabulous retention, just a nice, easy uh, in-out type of thing. Very, very smooth, very slick. Um, and that's basically it for the R1 Lawman. The other flashlight that we are getting into are, is the uh, Fury. Now, I know that there's several uh, variations of the Fury, but it's pretty universal size-wise. Some of them have a tactical ring here. And if it does have a tactical ring, of course, you got to have a bezel down. Now, on these smaller flashlights, we do offer bezel up, bezel down to your liking. And uh, just to give you an idea, I had one customer um, order it. This is Super Cam Camo, and um, he wanted it. Um, and this is what we call a uh, uh, roto clip. It's basically a roll-on twist off. Basically, uh, it's one-hand application. You can just roll it right onto the belt and uh, just twist it off. When it's on the belt coming up, um, does not come off in, in a later video. Um, hopefully I'll, I'll be able to uh, feature that on how you, how you wear it. But basically this is what it looks like. So in a tactical situation you can grab it quite quickly. And uh, the standard ones that we're offering, of course the color ones are a little bit of a, a, an upgrade, but if you want it in black this is how they come and we are obviously stocking these. And these do come with the roto clip. Now if you want it with a tech, cl uh, tech lock on there, it's a couple dollars more because obviously the, the lock itself costs uh, me a, a couple dollars more. So um, I do have that on my website. The other one that we're doing is uh, for the Phoenix light. This is a Phoenix PD. Uh, this is a 500 lumen flashlight. And um, basically uh, you can do bezel up or bezel down in these as well. 
and uh, really, really nice ergonomic type of flashlight holder. Very quick. I mean, my, my gear is, is uh, pretty simple, simplistic, keep it stupid simple kind of thing, and, uh, but very durable and uh, very functional. Um, that's pretty much how I gear um, when I uh, design this stuff. And once again, it has a roto clip, um, and these are on the website as well. So uh, I'm sure I can make other style flashlight holders and whatnot. Um, you know, just let me know what you have, and uh, if I get enough responses or, or, or requests for a certain one, I'll go out and buy them. But basically, just to give you an idea, just like everything else on my holsters and my mag holders and whatnot, I like to incorporate some type of adjustment. Um, a lot of people just give it to you and they say, well, this is what you have to deal with, and if it fits too tight or too loose, then it's, you know, tough luck. But uh, these screws here, it is held together with a couple of rubber uh, grommets, and you can tighten or loosen uh, depending on how you like it. Uh, but nonetheless, um, and they say all these holsters are available with the tech lock system, either the large or small, same, same price uh, for the tech lock. If you want it with a roto clip, we make these in house, obviously, uh, out of .125, and it is very, very tight. Uh, goes right onto the belt and uh, no problem. But um, you know, let me know if you have a different light that you'd like me to uh, to take a look at. Uh, but right now we have them in stock for the R1 Lawman, the uh, Surefire Fury, and the Phoenix uh, PD32. Uh, once again, my email is multiholsters at yahoo.com or my website for ordering colors. Um, all that kind of thing is www.multiholsters.com. Thanks for watching. Till next time, shoot straight.